my gorgeous angels and welcome back to another vlog. I hope you guys are all well. I've missed you guys so much. Today we have a really fun, exciting vlog because I have had Katie here today with me this weekend and today we thought we could go to the garden centre. We had a very cosy weekend together. I have vlogged a lot of it which would have been in the last vlog if you guys would have watched that. Today is Sunday for us so um, yeah we're just going to have a really nice cosy Sunday. I thought I could bring you guys along as usual so make Make sure you grab your cups of tea and biscuits and get yourself all cozy for a classic Ellie Darby and Kit Kat vlog. So I'm all ready. I've just done my makeup and my hair. Why does your hair only ever curl this well or like style nicely when it's like dirty? Well, not dirty. Do you know what I mean? But not freshly clean. Well, my curls literally never go like this when I've just washed it. But like day three... It always ends up looking a bit better. I'm just deciding what to wear because we are going to head out shortly. And I am actually working with Boohoo as part of today's video. So I thought I could run you guys through some outfits that they have kindly sent me. I do have a discount code for you guys, which I think is Ellie Darby. I'll pop it on the screen here for you. And also in the description box as well, um, as well as links to all of these outfits. Outfit number one, I'm not really planning on wearing this to the garden centre, but this is just a really cosy lounge outfit. It's actually so comfortable. It's a really nice thin material, which is actually perfect for days like today, which I are sunnier as you can see i think it's gonna be my dog walking outfit a bit later on today katie and herbie just playing out there our new sofa's arrived finally about two months late but yeah we bought a new sofa to call in the pagoda over there so i'm excited to sort that all out yeah i really like this one it is a gorgeous color like i said it's a really nice lightweight material so really nice and comfortable and perfect for days like today outfit number two i feel like has a little bit more classic me we've got a really nice oversized sweatshirt i love the color of this it says california los angeles i'm getting like do you know what i'm actually getting gilmore girl vibes from this sweatshirt i've only watched half of episode one but i really feel like it's gonna be my new autumn series thank you guys so much for telling me about that and then i've paired it with these really nice ribbed white cycling shorts and this is just like a really comfy cozy outfit to wear on a lazy sunday like today outfit number three is a little bit more down the vibe that i was thinking today i am obsessed with this jumper you just can't beat a nice chunky knit at this time of year it's got gorgeous balloon sleeves i love the color i love the cable knit style i think they do this jumper in a couple of other colors as well so I might be purchasing that. I had them with these jeans, which are actually so nice. I really, really like them. I love the color of them. They're also so high-waisted, really flattering, I think. They've got this really nice like open seam at the bottom. I think this might be my favorite so far. I really like it. And I also feel like Katie liked this outfit. Sis, yeah. do you like my jumper? Gorgeous. This outfit is actually a really strong contender as well. And I wasn't expecting it. How nice is this? This is called like the Beverly Hills sweatshirt or something. Like I said, I'll leave links to everything in the description box below, but it's California Tennis and Wellness Club. That is definitely something I wish I was a part of, but the sweatshirt will have to do for now. And then I've paired it with the seamless gym leggings, which are so high-waisted, they literally come up to about here. They're so comfy, and you guys know me, I love wearing a nice gym legging just to chill out in. I love the colour of them as well. E. I'm not being funny, but is this the coat of dreams or is this the coat of dreams? This is going to be my absolute new dog walking coat. I love this coat. It's literally like the perfect fit. I've paired it with these nice white rib joggers and then just a little staple bodysuit from Boohoo as well. Oh my God, I love this outfit. I wish it was freezing cold so I could wear this today. This is such a vibe, this coat. Oh my God, I actually really like it. I just feel like in autumn, winter, you really cannot be a long line puffer coat they just suit the occasion they make you look cool they make you look chill also they're super functional really really like this one finally last but not least i wish this was bonfire night today because is this just not the most perfect bonfire night setup I'm still wearing the same bodysuit and joggers but just with a different coat over the top instead sorry how amazing is this coat it's got this really cute hood as well oh i feel like little red riding hood oh my god or should i say little cream riding hood little beige riding hood oh i don't want to take this off i feel like this is the perfect girl and said to get up i wish 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 it was colder today i love this coat how nice is this i feel like you guys are gonna love this one the wide sleeves on it it's so comfy and cozy it is literally so oversized i think this is a size 10 and then also this scarf i'm sorry it's 
probably one of the softest things I've actually ever felt. Like the sort of material that you want your blanket to be made out of. Do you know what I mean? Oh, I love it. So thank you so much to Boohoo for working with me for today's video. Get to use my discount code if you purchase anything and let me know if you pick anything up. Right, here she is. Hello, angels. Excited for stasis? Oh yeah, hun. Tell the angels where we're going. So we are going to Whitehall. We're going to do like some autumn shopping, I think. Aren't oh we? yeah. I, do you know what? I actually think they might have their Christmas stuff in. No way. Yeah, they Already? Whitehall always get their Christmas stuff in. I really literally want to get, like, like an autumn puzzle. To yes. Like, an autumn puzzle to keep it dead so I can yeah. do it there. Yeah. So today is actually the first time we are going to Whitehall since we went with Mum last yeah. Christmas, isn't it? Yeah. How are you feeling about that? I feel okay. Me too, actually. Something that me and Katie find really helps us deal with grief is doing things that we would have done with our mum. Yeah. Isn't it? So doing lots of activities that we always used to do with her or doing things that maybe we wouldn't have done but she loved. Yeah. For instance, on her birthday, I went to go and um, have lunch around my mum's best friend's house, which of course isn't something that I would have done normally, but it's what my mum would have done. And we just find doing stuff like that really makes us feel close to mum, doesn't it? Yeah, it feels normal. Yeah. I just, saw a white, I just saw a white feather in the garden too. I saw a white butterfly in the garden <laughs> this morning. <laughs> yeah. She knows we're going to Whitehall, yeah, doesn't she? Yeah, she came up right close to me. <laughs> Wait for me. <laughs> so Whitehall was our mum's favourite garden centre. She absolutely loved going to garden centres, especially around autumn, winter. And we are just making it a mission of ours to go to as many garden centres as possible this autumn, aren't we? Yeah. This autumn, winter, to do loads of fun things that she would have loved. Sis, yeah. do you actually know what I thought we could have done? We could go to, when it gets a bit colder, when it's like maybe November or December, obviously if it's open with the virus and everything, we could go to the garden centre that we went to when we were in Devon. Dance farm. Yeah. It's a nice idea. Because she loved it there, didn't she? <laughs> yeah. And I thought like that'd be so Christmassy when it's yeah. winter time. So, yeah, we're excited for a little fun sister yeah. get away to Whitehall, aren't Definitely we? I can't sits. believe how long we haven't been in, actually. I'm Obviously, so excited. Because of the virus. I don't even know when it opened up again, but it was shut for ages. And usually yeah. we would have gone for like a spring trip, a summer trip. Yeah. But at least we're going back today. Oh my gosh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Is that one of mine? No. Oh, she stole loads of my scrunchies this morning. I thought I might have been one of it. <laughs> outfit, by the way, sis. When I put you on my Instagram story wearing that outfit the other day, the angels loved it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a new colour. It is a new colour for you, isn't it? Do you like it? Yeah, no, I love it. <laughs> you look great. Thanks, sis. <laughs> hey guys, it's me again. <laughs> um, I am the TJ in Ellie's car today and she is driving, so... She is concentrating very hard of and course. being the great big sister. Aw, thanks sis. <laughs> so I don't know which song we are going to have on today. Like it's up to you time. sis, you can choose today. Oh okay. What do you feel like boo? Anything, something I can sing along to you know. Okay. What do the angels recommend? Oh, I don't know, we can't hear them. <laughs> <laughs> Disney hits. Oh yeah! <laughs> Into the unknown. Oh my god, have you put it on? Yeah. OMG. Best song ever! <laughs> I can hear you, but I won't. <laughs> so I'm look for trouble. Look what that's like. Where? 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 Where we are, we're 
here. Hello, Rifle. Okay, sis, it's not as busy as I actually thought it might be. Not at all, is it, though? Look at all this. No one's saying be here. No one's saying stop that. Oh, um, have I just stupidly missed a really good car pay parking space right now? Do you know what? I'm just oh, going to do it, no. sis. I'm gonna park Why not, sis? Why just... not? Yeah, go ahead. <gasps> Oh my god, what? Look at those ladies having ice creams. <laughs> <laughs> that, will, that is what mum would be doing. <laughs> great parking space, boo. Yeah, it's a pretty great spot, right? Yeah. Right, here we go. Sis, I'm actually so excited to be here. What about you? Me too, sis. Oh, hello again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so they're gorgeous. gorgeous. Welcome to Whitehall. Why does this make me feel like I'm literally walking to Universal right now? That's how excited I am. <laughs> What has quarantine done to me? Oh my god, why are there sunbeds out? And not Christmas. Oh, I think they're still doing all the Christmas stuff through there, sis. Oh my god, what? This is so different. Oh my god, guys, usually all of that. Oh, look, no, they are doing the Christmas stuff. I can see it. Can you see it from the t on, over the top of the thing? How amazing. Oh, not quite yet. No. Rangers, we'll definitely bring you back with us. Oh my god, what the is this that bit shut off? Do you think that's because of the coronavirus or do you think that's because I think they're doing it? Do you reckon? Yeah. Oh, sis, I can't believe we've, we've missed the Christmas stuff. To be honest, it is September the 11th or whenever. It is September. Sis, actually, do you know what? The rose that I have in my garden, Yeah. me and mum got it from this bit right here. Oh, really? Yeah. She picked it out for me. Yeah, this was it. David Austin roses. And mine is like... This kind of colour, one of these oh, pinks. They? They're beautiful, aren't they? Wow, look at that one. Why do mine never look like that? Well, guys, I think unfortunately, this is the extent of Whitehall. It's actually just plants at the moment, which is. Love Mum would love reason. this. Is, this is Mum's <laughs> trip, <laughs> yeah. isn't it? She this is never our. Here. <laughs> we only like to come here for the Christmas bits, don't we, yeah. sis? Hopefully in a couple of weeks. She's making a lot of right now. Yeah, she'd make me be carrying around one of those massive trolleys, like one of the garden <laughs> centre trolleys that is like a weird trolley. <laughs> oh my god, just look another white butterfly. Literally right there. Hi mum. Hi mum. Look, it's literally right here. Oh my goodness. Where's that I go? She's like She's like, do you want to show that? <laughs> yeah, that is what she's like. <laughs> I can't believe how close it is. It's literally right there. <gasps> two. There's two of them. Oh my God. There's <laughs> three of them. There's three of them, sis. <laughs> There's literally three white butterflies. She's a friend. She said like a party. Oh my God, look at this white butterfly literally all around us. Oh, isn't that so nice, sis? <laughs> Literally cannot believe we just caught that on camera. Me either. That's so crazy, isn't it? Yeah. I've never seen three together. I've seen two together, but they've never been that close to me. Oh my God, that was just, that's just crazy. That's made me feel all warm and fuzzy. The Kit Kat has just squealed in delight at these decorated face masks. She says she really wants to get one. Go on then, sis. Oh yeah, because to be fair, I guess you are, you only have those ones, don't you? Oh, the rainbow one's cute. And that one? Yeah. I like the princess one. You like the princess one? What a butterfly. I like the flamingo one. Oh, yeah, all the butterflies. It's like a kid's size. Do you think it will still fit? I don't know, sis. Maybe. I don't see why it wouldn't. I literally cannot wait until all of this stuff is Christmas decorations. We stood literally here with mum last november december didn't we picking out a christmas puzzle literally yes, we right did. here yeah. right here well, i feel like harry potter again yeah that'll be cool we need to make sure we get some good ball games for christmas this year sis yeah i bought monopoly deal the other day oh look at these bottles oh hello cups thank you i am very busy that's definitely you <laughs> yeah i know <laughs> this is the Oh look, the puzzles. Oh, yeah. snoozing in the shed. Oh, that one's nice. 
I like the dressmaker's story to one. Yeah. We need to actually make sure that we finish a puzzle this Christmas. Yeah, we do. Because last we always just start one, don't we? Yeah, and we don't finish it. Hey, sis, you might like some of this stuff. I'm braving up. I used to love this stuff when I was little. Painting by numbers. Oh, my God, that was such a vibe. Oh, I used to love painting by numbers. Anyone else? See, this is like my idea of heaven, actually. A nice chilled Sunday, coming yeah. to look around a garden centre. Just looking at the stuff they do, I just love it. One of our mum's favourite ever brands was East of India. Literally, whenever I see anything that is like this, it always makes me think of her. Yeah. Do you know what I mean, sis? It so does, doesn't it? Oh, it's just all so cute, look like these little jugs. I love it. I also really like this brand, Katie Loxton London. I saw this wedding planner and I literally love it. I've been looking for a really nice wedding planner since the day I got engaged, pretty much. This is how this one looks inside. Guests, budget, dress, venue, honeymoon. Sis, can you believe I'm going to be sorting all that stuff out? No, I can't. Crazy, isn't it? I know. I also really love these ones, beautiful bridesmaid candles. So I've actually already asked three of my bridesmaids oh to be my, my bridesmaids I have just a couple more to ask and i really want to ask them in like a really nice way like have a big bridesmaid box in there and put some nice stuff in there so i think i might buy a couple of those to put in my bridesmaid boxes when i ask my bridesmaids to be my bridesmaids sis you should you should get some of these what these little notes yeah they look yeah. cute don't they yeah yeah Gorgeous brand. They've also got another brides kind of there, brides notes. That's just like a notebook. Kit Kat are currently in yeah. heaven. Oh, look, lemon and gin curd, sis. Mm. <gasps> sea salted caramel sauce. Oh my god, stop! I cannot wait to come here and do a massive Christmas food shop. We're totally gonna have to do that this year, sis. Yeah. Right? Lime curd. This garlic mayonnaise. Oh my oh. lord. I didn't even know that this brand did so many sauces. Of our sauces, don't we, sis? And curds. Yeah. Because the um, bar Christmas markets are off this year, sis. Yeah. We'll come here and get all of our like cheese and curds and stuff in here. It's a nice idea. Because we always get lemon curd from the bar Christmas market, don't we? Yeah. And cheese. But we'll just come here and get it this year, sis. That's a good idea, isn't it? Yeah. I'll cast lemon curd. She's oh. so tempted. Sis. Shall I get it and you can keep it at my house and then whenever you come to my house you can have it on toast and stuff. That's a nice. And that can be your breakfast. Yeah. yeah? Tick lemon curd. It's just they do elderflower curd. Oh my gosh. Or all butter lemon curd. Get the sparkling elderflower one. Oh sis, oh, no wait, banoffee curd. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, should we get that one? <laughs> yeah, why not? Mum would love this. Yeah, I know. Right, we Ooh. are back in the car. It's a shame they didn't have their Christmas stuff out, but it is what it is. Mm. So, because you've been such a great sister for a long time now, I thought I'd, well, you always are, anyway. But I got you a little pamper Sis! Yes. <laughs> what, how did you even manage to sneak that in? <laughs> what are you like? <laughs> What are you like, honestly, <laughs> sis? Oh, that is so lovely. Thank you so yeah. much. I can do that later. Yeah. Thank you, sis. What a lovely treat. <laughs> I can't believe you did that. We were together the whole time. I didn't even know that you had done that. <laughs> did you keep it a secret from me? Yeah. How <laughs> lucky am I to have a sister like you, hey? <laughs> Right, now, angels, oh my god, you're literally not even going to believe what our next step is. Oh my gosh. We have to go and pick up a hungover Connor. Oh no! From his friend's house. He went out last night, didn't he, sis? Yeah. So we had a sister night. So yeah, we did have a sister night and it was lovely. Which was so lovely. So yeah, he stayed at his friend's house, so now I have to drive and pick him up. Right. Oh look, I've got a new passenger in the passenger seat today. Oh, who's that? Mr. Connor Swift, my husband to be actually. Oh, Do you like being okay. called my husband to be? Don't mind it. Well, con you know what? I was actually hoping for a bit more enthusiasm than that. Fiance. Good morning, angels. Now look, it's the day after. The day after. <coughs> no, it's not. I picked you up yesterday, didn't I? Yeah, you didn't vlog that, did you? Yeah. Well, no, I didn't vlog picking you up because Jesus Christ. 
Angels, you didn't want you to didn't see want me to yesterday. None of the angels need Blimey. to be exposed to that. Oh my god. But it's the next day. How are you feeling, my love? Sometimes he struggles with two day hours because he's a bit old. Owls. Don't exploit me like that. Also, but I am I am feeling the two day hangover. Can you tell in my voice? It's a little bit It is a bit croaky. Well, Look, how about this? Your fiance is not looking too hot to try either. That's why I have to put my sunglasses on because honestly, I don't even want well. to expose you guys to how I look today. I look rough, right? I look really rough. Hey, sis, do you want to not poke your head round? And do you want to tell the angels what we're actually doing today? Hey. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I can't move. She got under a seatbelt. Yeah, I didn't realise that he was on camera. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, we are going to go look at houses. On <gasps> what? Look to two today. <laughs> Yes, me and Katie we already went to look at two houses. House I only get called out for the big ones. Mr. Swift is coming for the third one today. We've what time is it? Us. Three o'clock. We have to get going. In a Three o'clock? It's not even two. Oh no, it's two o'clock. Oh. Just keeping you on your toes, love. Me on my toes. So yeah, that's Katie's exciting news, everybody. We thought we could tell you because <gasps> we're only looking, aren't we, sis? Yeah. We're Just only looking. looking. So no big deal. Um, by the way, it's so hot, I feel like we've just been transported back to July. It's pretty, it's pretty hot. Do you know what I mean? Look, sunroof is coming open, that's how hot it is. And we've got a mini little heat wave, and you've got to fuel up, Al. you're not getting there in time. Yeah, we'll have to fuel up on the way back. Will we make it? Yeah. yeah 26, 26 miles. miles. I can drive to Bath and back, my love. So, that's our exciting news today, that's what we're up to. Katie's making a pros and cons list of everything that she is seeing today. You've got your notepad, Kit Kat? Yeah. yeah, love that. Yeah. Show the angel, sis. Notepad. There it is. There's her notepad. Well, actually, it's my notepad. Oh, oh yeah. Katie stole sadly. it. <laughs> what do you mean, sadly? Sad. Yeah, angels, we don't know if we're going to show you the house because that's maybe a little bit TMI. private. So that's Katie, though, isn't it? Look out for the Katie's Moving House vlog. What? Oh, it's exciting. Might be coming soon, might be coming not so soon. We're just going to take it easy and see where the day takes us. Right, everyone? It's much cheaper, isn't it? Yeah. Right, angels, we are home and we are sitting in the garden. <laughs> Yes, so is Herbie. We've picked up a Subway on the way back from the house viewings, which by the way, were very successful. They went very well. And Subway cookies are literally so underrated. This is a chocolate chip candy one, I think it's called. Really nice. So yeah, we're just sitting outside in the garden, which is actually really nice because I kind of thought that our sitting in the garden days were over. But because of the gorgeous weather today, we can sit on our new sofa that actually just arrived yesterday, so I haven't even shown you guys this yet. It's comfy, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So this is how the pagoda is looking. I also got a new little table to go here. So it looks like this little setup over here. Really nice. Katie's sitting on the footstool, even though she does have a big chair behind her. And then just how the house viewing went. Number one, loved mm -hmm. it. Yep. Number two, didn't number love it. Three, Perfect. It's really yeah. nice. House number modern. three was your favourite, wasn't it? Yeah, it's like really modern and stuff inside, so happy, happy, happy. Doesn't need any work doing. No, not at all. It's a nice house, good location. So we've had a nice afternoon and now we're just chilling out with the sun. The one thing about the nice weather, even though I'm a little bit annoyed because it's September, which means it's supposed to be autumn and chilly it does mean oh look a white butterfly oh we're seeing them so much aren't we sis yeah that we can come and sell in the gorgeous garden that i do love okay my gorgeous angels that is going to go ahead and finish off today's video i really hope you guys enjoyed it you guys are loving and enjoying the heat wave we're having this week um me and herbie definitely are herbie say hello hello you say darling we love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much again for watching and we will see you in the next one. Bye.